Hello, I'm Richard Dolan. Last year, during the first year of our new normal lockdown upside down world, we decided to do a first for us, which was to offer our very own single day online conference in which attendees could watch new analyses and presentations while also interacting with me and other speakers in real time. It was an all day event and there I was able to introduce a new perspective on the UFO phenomenon and where we as a society were headed. That included my speculative analysis of the alien agendas and what I have come to call the fourth stage of humanity. Well, this year we're doing another event, something that I think not only will go further than what we did last year, but in a virtual environment that quite honestly blew me away when I tried it out. I'll get to that in a moment, but first let me tell you what we've got planned. The single day event will be on Thursday, May 20th, 2021, and is titled UFO Secrecy in a Changing World. As with last year, I'll be offering two completely fresh analyses of where we are headed. The first is called UFO Secrecy, the 2030 scenario, in which I discuss where the UFO subject is headed for the rest of this decade. This will include an institutional analysis of UFO slash UAP secrecy, including the official government and military channels, as well as the black budget structure and also the known and, and likely corporate players. I'll be talking about the tools available to UFO researchers and activists who are interested in revealing the truth about UFOs, and I'll examine several potential scenarios that we're likely to see coming down the road, all while considering the larger political and technological trends in our world. My second analysis will cover an old UFO theme, but in a new way. It's called UFO Crash Recoveries, a Classified Corporate Gold Rush. Yes, I have talked about the acquisition of exotic technology by the military and, and black budget world, but this time I'm going to go deeper into not just the testing and the attempts to replicate this type of technology, but the likely corporate players involved and the revolutionary nature of the sciences and the technologies involved. What has been developed over the years is a bizarre system of what I often call legal illegality and one of massive profit for certain organizations. You won't want to miss either one of these talks. Now, in addition, I'll be joined by some brilliant and knowledgeable people. First is Lou Elizondo, who, of course, was the head of the Pentagon's ATIP program. That is the formerly secret UFO research group that began operation during the George W. Bush years and which we learned about in 2017. Lou has been quite vocal about many aspects of that program and of the reality of the UFO UAP phenomenon. He'll be with us on May 20th to have an in-depth interview with me, and he'll be back for another session in which he and I will be on together to answer your direct questions. I'll also be joined by four researchers, sometimes known as the Young Guns. I love these guys. They are Jay from Project Unity over on YouTube, James Iandoli from the YouTube channel Engaging the Phenomenon, Danny Silva of the Silva Record, and Joe Mergia, who operates the news blog UFOjoe.net. These researchers have been at the forefront of some of the most important issues facing ufology today, and they will be providing their perspectives on the challenges and opportunities facing us now and in the future, while also interacting with you and answering your questions. We're at an important crossroads, not just in our confrontation of the UFO mystery and the secrecy uh, surrounding it, but in the direction and future of our entire civilization. Now let me talk about our platform. Our event this year will be held on a virtual campus custom designed just for us. Although in my opinion, nothing can replace genuine face-to-face -face, in person contact, I have to say this virtual experience is far beyond anything I expected to see anytime soon. If we are going to remain locked down, we at least can use a next level virtual environment to make this experience something special. So when you sign up, you'll have access to our campus in which you need three minutes basically to create your own customized avatar. And you're then in a secure place in which you can not only attend the presentations and interact with the speakers, but you can connect with anyone else there, just like at a normal event in the real world. You can go to any number of virtual environments you like and have direct voice conversations with anyone in a private and secure manner. You'll be able to interact with me and the other speakers as well, since we're going to be around for the entire rest of the evening after the presentations are over, just like at a conference in real life. 
One of the great things I've missed from live in-person events is the amount of interaction that takes place during the downtimes and after the lectures. Our platform allows us to do just that. It's kind of amazing. And if you don't care about bumping into any avatars and you just want to check out the information that is provided there, you can just do that. This event can be as straightforward or as involved as you want it to be. It's totally up to you. So that's the interface, and when you sign up, you'll be given an information packet that will easily guide you through getting set up. We also have a great team of people who will be there actually to greet you when you arrive, so you won't be wandering around wondering, where is everyone? I want to present information that is important to you and that gives you the tools to understand our world and the incredible subject of UFOs. And I'm very pleased that we're going to be able to do that in such an engaging virtual setting. It's May 20th. No plane fare, no hotel, no hassle, but you do get an immersive virtual event that I think will be truly something special. UFO secrecy in a changing world. Learn more by clicking the link below. I look forward to seeing you there and actually having a conversation with you.